Well, uh, and I, I have to do a disclaimer here because uh, I have a I have a company uh, that uh, David Kaplan and I co co um, founded called Amorphaceuticals Inc. So uh, we are pursuing this kind of thing. But uh, to me, the biggest barrier to really transformative regenerative medicine is the uh, universal assumption that living things are best controlled at the micro hardware level that we should be looking at pathways, rewiring pathways, individual genes, uh, genome editing, that kind of stuff. Uh, there will be low hanging fruit that are addressable that way, I'm sure. Uh, but the general power of regenerative medicine is not going to be achieved that way. I don't think, I think what we do need to do is to figure out what the innate competencies of cells and tissues are. We need to understand how to communicate with them and, uh, we need to exploit their uh, the intelligence of cellular collectives to call up outcomes that are too complex for us to micromanage, like growing back organs and so on.